Hi everyone! So today's video is going to be February favorites. I know I'm a little bit late on it, and I know I haven't made a video in like three weeks. Um, school and work have been super duper 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 hectic. Um, I'm finishing up my quarter in school, so I have a whole bunch of projects and tests and finals that are all coming up. And work has um, picked up a little bit, so I am getting more hours there. So it's been really hard to find time to make a video, and then when I do have some free time, it's always late at night, lighting isn't great, and I'm just always so tired. But anyway, I'm hoping that soon I will be able to um, really make a lot more videos. Uh, so after next week, I uh, should be a little bit better with school. I would, I'm going to have two weeks left. So hopefully I can um, get back into the swing of things. But anyway, on with the February favorites. Um, during the month of February, I did not buy any makeup whatsoever. Um, I kind of refrained a little bit because in January I had a pretty big um, mix haul. Um, so I now have makeup to the point where there's still some stuff that I haven't used yet. So I don't want to add to my makeup collection and then just keep pushing products aside. So I want to make sure that I at least get use of what I have at the moment. Um, so with that said, my February favorites consist of four items. So anyway, first one is a Rimmel lipstick. And this is an Airy Fairy. And it is 070. And this is the perfect neutral color for me. Um, it's the same color as my lips, like dead on. I've been wearing this, no joke, every day. Even if I don't put foundation on or any eye makeup on, I always reach for this and I always just slap it on. You can barely tell that I have lipstick on because it blends in with my natural lip color so well. But at the same time, it does make my lips look really polished. And it is what I'm wearing on my lips right now. I did put underneath um, the lipstick a lip liner. So it is coming off just a little bit um, more pigmented than it actually is. So I really, really am loving this. And it is so moisturizing. Like, I do not even have to wear a gloss with this. This is how good and moisturizing it is. So next item is my Nivea Lip Moisture. That is all I have left. I've been using this multiple, multiple times a day. Um, I was running into, that's what the package looks like, I was running into problems with when I put on my um, lipstick, you could really see the fine lines and my lips were just chapped and gross and every time I would put on a lipstick it just did not look pretty. So I decided that I really needed to start taking care of my lips. So I've been moisturizing them with this day in and day out. I mean, I keep this on the counter in my bathroom and every time I walk into the bathroom, whether it be to pick up a tissue or to wash my hands, I always pick this up and slap it on my lips. And it has made such a difference. My lips are so moisturized. I don't have those fine lines anymore. So when I put on lipstick, it actually goes on very smoothly. And I'm just totally loving it. And I'm definitely going to pick up another one when I run out. Next item is my big tub of Eucerin Dry Skin Therapy Original Moisturizing Cream. Um, as mentioned in my skincare video, I do have eczema on my elbows and my eyelids were uh, really starting to become red and irritated. So um, I use this, put it on my elbows um, every night and every um, night after I wash my eyelids with a little bit of baby shampoo and hot water, I put this on there as well and I just love it. it keeps my eyelids moisturized, keeps my elbows moisturized, and I've not, ever since I've been using this since November, ever since then, my eyelids never been red, my elbows never been red. So I really like this. I have extremely dry skin, so this is perfect. And it is about $13. You can get it at any drugstore, but it's going to last you a really, really, really long time. I don't know if you can quite see that, but I like have barely made a dent in it, so... Really loving that. And last but not least, a body spray. This is from Victoria's Secret. And it came out with um, 
three of their scents for the holiday. This is in Gilded Ginger Cream, and it smells exactly like gingerbread. I love it so much. Every time I wear this, I can smell it for like hours after I've sprayed on me. It is amazing. I smell delicious. I just want to eat it. I do have gingerbread cookies in my cabinet right now. I kind of want to eat them right now, but I love it. It smells amazing. Yeah, awesome. So, really loving this as well. So those are my February favorites. Um, I'm not quite sure whether or not I'm going to buy anything in the month of March. I'm still kind of debating. Like I said, there's still a lot of makeup that I do want to use before I just add to my collection. Um, but so I don't know if I'm going to make a March favorites. I guess we'll see. We'll see um, how how I am doing as far as using the makeup that I haven't used yet and what products I may rediscover in my collection. So um, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I'm going to have a whole bunch of videos. I actually made a list yesterday of a bunch of videos that I want to um, film for you guys. So, But if you have any requests at all, um, please let me know. Um, I only have a very short list, so I'm going to run out of ideas very soon. So um, let me know what you guys like to see. And thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye.